heart for those who serve. We run food rescue trucks down the road every day you know, that are manned with one driver and one volunteer. We pick up and deliver you know, 1.5 million pounds of food a year. We've got volunteers that serve in our kitchens and volunteers that are on the front lines preventing hunger in our community. What's really cool for me um, is this isn't a person that is um, out front in one of those really forward-facing roles, um, but somebody that's driving um, programs and, and events that um, generate the, the revenue that it takes to, to drive my truck. Most of the ways that this individual has given to our organization, other than philanthropically, has been behind the scenes preparation and transformation of the things that we've chosen to do to try to be um, stewards to the community and fundraising events that have benefited the different programs that we have. The, the one word that, that I, would, I, I would wrap up um, for this person would be horsepower. So, dig in, we're going to get stuff. That's where she aspires to be great. This is a person to definitely have in your corner. Anything that they agree to be part of and head off with their marching orders, you know that the product is going to be far better than you could ever have imagined. Their creativity, their innovation, their passion and commitment for doing a good job is there every single time. Without the support of, of, of that individual, um, our, our effort you know, wouldn't be possible. What this person does for goodwill is uh, like a beautiful. I'll just tell you a quick story about you know, what, what I think really encapsulates what this person is about. Um, you know, the, they ended up you know, having a family member in the hospital, and you know, during that time in the hospital, when when most people would be you know just kind of you know, taking some time to, to rest and, and, and be together as a family, um, they brought in the decorations that needed to be made for the event that we had going on the next week and the whole family um, was enlisted in, in the creation of, of decorations um, for the event so it's like no minute wasted uh, we got no time to lose and we're going to use this as an opportunity uh, to create good in our community and, and that you know, for me really says a ton about you know not only the person's drive but but their character um, and their passion for for serving this year at home yeah when i found out this individual was the nominee it was wow this is really great should be totally blown away and I think it will just mean that someone recognized her for what she loves to do. And so, if this person hasn't already figured it out, um, I will just quickly say that uh, as the video touched on, we're blessed at Goodwill with incredible volunteers just literally part of the fabric of everything we do and I'm thrilled that I get to work with them and help them find that niche that's right for them but in this case um, this Mary Stanton volunteer of the year found her own niche and taught us what her niche was um, I don't get a uh, the privilege of hands-on as much as a lot of the people in the outlying um, event and fundraisers do, but Lily Clark, who you know, is running around here like a mad woman doing this event, shared with me that in the fundraising events that, uh, that this individual is part of, it takes it from a fundraiser, a, a, a function, a party, and it transforms it into something that is not to be missed ever. Um, the way that it feels, the way that it warms your spirit and your heart are because of her talents, resources, and resourcefulness. And as the honoree Mary Stanton said, and she's just plain fun to be around. So would Ray Burden make her way to the stage, please?
winners all hang. And actually, her husband Terry's already on it. Thank you. <laughs>